folks, well this is when we go from the embargo man channel. Like one thing I am so sick and tired of, of hearing is these type of things. <laughs> Call it the bad. These are called the bad news dogs. All right. Bad news about pit bulls. All right. I mean, I have seen some YouTube videos about pit bulls saving people's lives and stuff. Of a pit bull taking up a bullet from from this guy who was about to rob a get robbed at gunpoint. Yeah, I mean. All these are good news about pit bulls, right? Even a pit bull saving somebody from the train or something like that. Okay, but then, but then all the bad news come in instance, you know, you know that it, it wastes. Like, oh yeah, pit bull bit bit me, or pit bull attack my other dog, or my or pit bull attack my chihuahua and stuff, right? Of course, this isn't. This isn't a coincidence that you're putting such a bad rap on this at first hearing all this BS, right? I'm hearing all these BS about that, about pit bulls attacking other animals or other pets or other people and they're not even noticing it, right? There's a lot of good news about it. Pit bulls saving people's lives, attacking somebody, try to attack or, 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 you know, or whatever it is. That is the type of thing is that I want to hear about these dogs. Pit bulls saving the owner's lives, right? I mean, I knew some one of my cousins had pit bulls. I was just chicken enough, but then after that, in there, you know. Get a little conference with a pit bull, right? <laughs> yes, it is. And then what I heard of them, oh yeah, they're very good with kids and whatever. I mean, they're good with children. I mean, put it that way. Their strength and everything, they're very, they have a very tough bite and whatever. So, put all these news and questions. There is a bunch of, I'm talking about not just baseball bat, uh, bat related, uh, you know, murders or anything like that, knife related murders, knife related murders, and people are get, getting killed by knives, but, you know, there's, but just in one country that I would love to visit, that says a very peaceful, super strict gun laws, well, of course, I'm talking about that and talking about this is where I'm gonna take the pit bull and this is where I could hear some good news about pit bulls right something good about pit bulls I mean put it put it this way or whatever you see in the title of the video it seems kind of rare but I mean all the all the bad press about pit bulls and all that stuff, all the bad rap it would take, even a pit bull in China has killed some other, some other, somebody else's dog, and, and that, you know, like, pressure, and, oh yeah, I was just thinking, oh yeah, they worry about the other dog, but what about the pit bull? The pit bull, alright? It is just like a bad train pit bull, you know, poorly trained, alright, you need to be well trained, these, these dogs have to be well trained, and they love you, all it is a little TLC, and that's it, what you need with these dogs, right, so they have the incident in China, about a pit bull attacking some other dog, and they worry about, yeah, you know what, yeah, this is enough with, enough with the bad rap about pit bulls, enough of this, enough, but then, let me put you in, another Another video is a, 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 a pit bull attacking a beagle and its owner. <laughs> I'm just saying this is what it is, bad press, video, 
all right, I don't want to hear that. I want I I love to hear what people say people's lives when somebody comes out with a knife and and then attack somebody. Most likely the cases are most likely in the U.S. and stuff, you know. But most likely, this is with, with uh, what I what this is why it's called pit bulls in Japan, right? So, what is this video about pit bulls in Japan, right? It is just one of these rare cases because there have been. If I'm reading on on the face on my Facebook about this about this crap about deaths relating knives. One is on self defense. Not to worry. This is just a punk that trying to try to you know try to you know rape. On his girlfriend or whatever it is, and then she defends back with a kitchen knife and stuff, you know, a way to defend herself, right? Stab his ass and and that's it. But then what I'm talking about is pit bulls. Pit bulls, in the other hand, I mean, this is this is this is the no sword and no guns for civilians law in Japan, right? This is not just a at least if some uh, Islamic terrorist attacks happen, then it's a whole different story, and Robert Spencer going on, that's just a video that I'm going to come up with in my mind when I return to the U.S., and not that, and, and it's not what it's going to be about, but this is more about pit bulls in Japan. I mean, what it is, is that, exactly, put the story short, is gonna be big news about pit bulls saving their owners, and what I wanna hear is, yeah, somebody come out with a knife, right? Yeah, this is this is all knife related, you know, knife deaths, right? And deaths, murder related with a knife, right? So put it this way, this is where a pit bull is involved. I mean, the person try to freaking stab. Pitbull rages and gets the owner. Owner goes no. Pit, I mean, excuse me. Pitbull rages and gets the attacker and protects the owner from being stabbed. The guy just drops the knife and the pitbull just bit him out. You know, and 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 that would be somewhere in Japan. Put for for suddenly that a pitbull. If this kind of thing, if this kind of heroic stuff happens where a pit bull attacks somebody that attacks its owner, then it would be a great news about that. This is great news. Even Give Me a Break Man would be it. And that would be, wow, it would be an amazing story about a pit bull saving somebody else's life from being stabbed. I mean... In that incident and happening in Japan, that mean it would be a big story. It would be a big story about so, about somebody, and more, most likely a woman, having some creeper and they're chasing. He, this guy grabs a knife. A pit bull attacks on the guy, and part of the guy might be dead or whatever it is. That's the that's the kind of story I want to hear. Pitbull saving an owner's life, owner's life from ba from getting stabbed. I mean, I've seen even training video how they train pitbulls to attack, to attack intruders, right? But yeah, but this case, in this scenario, put it this way, put it this way about pitbulls. I mean, it would be interesting to see to to see that kind. of that, that kind of story of all good news about pit bulls. A pit bull saving a life from somebody who is about to get stabbed. Right? And and that would be a very interesting story. Whatever is gonna be more most interesting, what is gonna be most interesting, probably I haven't heard about the Miami Dade or the police department, Miami-Dade Police Department, telling them, and probably somebody 
with him. Who is related, to, might be related to a YouTuber that I always think that it might happen. It might happen that I think, I probably like somebody on Facebook, who might probably have a boyfriend who is a former Miami Dade police officer or whatever. I'm just saying I'm going to stay three months in Colombia spending time with my father and stuff. But I might say this. What is going to happen, it would be really, really, really big news about a pit bull save, being saved. I mean, saving a relative... A relative, the owner who is a relative of a popular YouTuber that is Pitbull saved that relative from being stabbed on her trip to Japan, right? That would be quite interesting, right? The quite interesting story that even, that even freaking news from her hometown might just say, wow, this is a great story about a Pitbull saving this particular YouTuber's life that her relative was a former police officer from Miami Day that lives in Japan and and just saying yes and then you see all the story about oh yeah love this pit bull blah 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 maybe they might just have Mari they might just have Mario from Super Mario Brothers and a new game and name of the Pitbull, you know, the Pitbull would be Mario's pet or something like that, Mario has a dog who's a Pitbull, just because of that incident, that it didn't seem to happen, that, yes, this popular YouTuber would be, of course, of course, that, that would be kind of odd, and then maybe, maybe the Steelers would have this Rally dog, who is that pit bull who saved that YouTuber's life in Japan from a stabber? <laughs> it would be a, just a coincidence and just kind of odd about of all these things, right? That I do believe that in Miami Day you can't have any pit bulls, right? That means that they are considered, you know, very vicious dog owners because of the all the bad publicity about that. But at the end, they're very great guard dogs. And so there are some pit bulls that are being used as canine units for the police force. Of course. But all odds are is that seeing this thing that that what would ha what would happen? What would happen of this? What would happen if this popular YouTuber goes and visits her cousin in Japan. Cousins quit the police department. He cannot have a pit bull where he lives. But in this new place, he had a pit bull. The pit bull protects his cousin from being attacked from somebody who's going to get stabbed. Of course... That, that, that's gonna be big news. They're gonna freaking have Mario having a pet pit bull because of just that pit bull. Or the rally dog for many. For the Pirates, for the Steelers. A rally dog, right? A rally dog is, could be that particular pit bull, right? Because that's. It is from her hometown. Well, and first of all. Other than that, about the uh, about that pit, good news about pit bull incident in Japan, <laughs> yeah, a good news incident in Japan about a pit bull saving a, a YouTuber's life, yeah, that from getting stabbed. Then I might say, I might say her co her cousin has has a pit bull and she has a poodle. Put it this way. <laughs> Pit bull in Japan save her life from being from us from somebody trying to stab her. 
Yes, that would be so awesome incident that a pit bull saves a life of a blonde woman being stabbed and I was about to be, to be stabbed in Japan. Yeah, good news about pit bull. This is good news about a pit bull, alright? Yeah, a relative's pit bull saving her life from being stabbed. <laughs> you know, this is would be good news. This would be that just in, in, in the in the media in Japan, in Japan, but like those those, those Miami, well, former Miami Dade police officer who cannot have this type of dogs in Miami Dade have a type of dog in Japan and related to this YouTuber and this and this and that and save save the save this woman's life from from being stabbed or from that YouTuber's hometown like all those like a Pittsburgh Herald Pittsburgh Tribute or whatever it is and they say oh yeah this pit bull saved her life I mean that's what I want to hear. I want to hear good news about pit bulls, alright? <clears throat> a pit bull saving somebody else's life from being attacked. And that's what it is, pit bulls in, in Japan story. Yeah, I want to hear something about a pit bull in Japan saving somebody else's life. But the biggest news I want to hear, a pit bull in Japan who has a foreigner living there. <laughs> saving a YouTuber's li life, who is a relative of a YouTuber, saving a YouTuber's life, that she would post it on YouTube and say about the pit bull. And she would say about the pit bull, I know who, who she is. But she'll say, she'll say something about the pit bull, how sweet, the, how sweet all those dogs in and whatever, blah, 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 blah. And, and, and then she said she loved it. Her cousin's pit bull. Of course, mm, odds are you have the Pirates baseball team using this as a rally, using this pit bull as a rally dog because of our hometown. Or probably a football team using the rally pit bull because of our hometown. On the trip to Japan. Get an attack by somebody to try to stab her, and the pit bull attack the stabber. <laughs> Drops the knife and whatever this incident it's going on. But I want to hear about the story, so write me a comment of what you think about not just in Japan, but good news about pit bulls, especially for this one. Then I'm just crossing my fingers and say about. How a, a YouTuber going to a trip to Japan, visit her relatives, and getting attacked by, her. and she want to get attacked by somebody that's gonna stab her, and that pit bull saves her life. I want to hear that. I want to hear that story, and I do believe that. I just do believe that there's somebody who is about to go there and. Have a pit bull, you know. I mean, what only choice did they have with stricter, a country with stricter gun laws? But you could have a pit bull, right? I mean, the pit bull, or, I mean, in Japan, I think the pit bull or any fierce or any bad news dog to then also attack people are like the best form to people protect themselves. Even people who try to do with stabbing attacks, you know, knife attacks, murder, and preventing murder and, and involving knives. I mean, these dogs, pit bulls in Japan, would be the best prevention to stop the victims for, from people, for stop being victims of knives, of knife-related murders. And that's what I think about pit bulls. Yeah. Pit bulls are like, for some people who are never even aware about the news.
news about stabbings and the knives, knife-related murders and stuff. Some people, then individuals, when saying, yeah, I'm going to keep a pit bull as a pet, a pit bull attack because the guy tried to stab me or this person tried to stab me. So the pit bull attacked that SOB and and it drops, the, the SOB drops the knife, pit bull saved my day. I want to hear that kind of story because that's what I want to hear. Good news about pit bulls. Good news about pit bulls saving the lives of their owners. All of this happening in Japan. So goodbye and peace out everybody.